In level two, we're attempting to increase the intensity of the extensive short coupling bounce series by increasing return, meaning we're starting out jumping and returning in the direction we came from. These first three jumps that we add in here are the extensive bounces going side to side, vertical, and forward and back. In phase two, we also add some complexity to the jumps by starting out with 90 degree bounces. In these, we're just trying to get the athletes to spring up off the ground and turn 90 degrees in midair. We also add in some multi-directional bounces where the athletes are going to go and change direction in a pattern that's predetermined. The first of which is a square bounce where they're going to go forward 90 degrees to the side, backwards 90 degrees in the opposite direction, and then they're going to return to the starting point. They're going to do these both clockwise and counterclockwise. And the final one we add are triangle bounces. And in these, we're going to start going forward at an angle, backwards at an angle, and then directly to the side, both clockwise and counterclockwise. And then we're going to finish off going backwards at an angle, forwards at an angle, and then again straight to the side, performing these both clockwise and counterclockwise. These increases and in change of direction challenge the foot and ankle complex in a multitude of different ways to prepare it for level three.